guest is a legend of the cinema, a film icon. She's in a new movie called Potiche. I think that's how you say it. I don't know. I'm not actually French. <laughs> Uh, Portiche, it's in theatres on March the 25th. Please welcome Catherine Deneuve, everybody. Catherine Deneuve. That's what they said, that you would help me. Yeah, I will help you. Where would you like it? Where you want. And where will I put the microphone? <laughs> uh, is that, is that working? I think that's fine, yes. Yeah, I can hear you, so we're good. <laughs> <laughs> How lovely to meet you and, and, and welcome to the show. I, I'm a, a huge fan of your work. I, uh, I like French films. Yes. <laughs> and you're in a lot of them, aren't you? <laughs> Do you speak French? No. Um, but, uh, it, 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 not in, uh, I haven't been to France in a long time. I used to go to Paris a great deal. I had a friend there who was a lady. You insisted on lady, yeah? Well, she was a lady most of the time. Uh, when you say you like French films, you mean you don't mind the subtitles? No, no, I, I like a good subtitle. Oh, that's quite rare for an yeah, American. Yeah. No, I mean, subtitled movies do very well. Here, the, uh, the uh, Swedish movie that just came out did extremely well. They, uh, yeah, people don't mind them anymore. It's fine. <laughs> is, is this... That's is, not what I heard. Really? Is this movie subtitled? <laughs> oh, well, I hope it would be subtitled. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, because a lot of Americans don't speak French. That's going to be awkward. No, I don't... Is Gerard Depardieu in the movie? Yes, as you talk he, to he him. He is? Yes. Oh. As, as much as he can, yes. <laughs> You didn't catch the monologue, did you? I did. Oh. But I won't tell him. No, no. I mean, I am actually am a fan of Jared Dippard. He's a great actor. He's a fantastic actor. actor. He's a great actor, yeah. yeah. He's got that, uh, that nose. It's not so much the nose. He has that incredible voice. Yeah. He has and, an incredible voice. He's presence. a great actor. Yeah, yeah. Well, he, has a, he always had a problem, you know, with over, over, overweight, you know? I hadn't noticed. No, did he? Uh... <laughs> Oh, you can talk because you're thin. That's no, easy, huh? I, listen, I've struggled with my weight. I used to be much fatter, and then I stopped drinking uh, lattes. Lattes? What's that? Uh, coffee with, coffee coffee with creme, milk. But, oh, uh, yeah. yeah, but, but you know, uh, very Are you thin. sure you will be put on weight because of café crème? Yes. And cakes. Ah, OK. <laughs> Because every time I had a cafe creme, I had a yes, muffin. Yes, of course, a yeah. little croissant. I always, but I eat a lot when I go to Paris, but I lose weight because I walk around all the time. Do you walk a lot in Paris? Yes, I do. I yeah. do. I like to walk. Yeah. I like Paris. I like, uh, I used to like the uh, Jardin du Luxembourg and the... That's where uh, I live. Really? Mm. In the park? No, well, very close to the park. Oh. I wish, I dream to live in the little house of the person who it's keeps the lovely, park. It's lovely, yeah. There's no. a beautiful little house at and the end. And the little angle, boating no. thing there where the, the children yes, go and they yes, move yes, the little yes. boats. That's very nice. That's very it? nice. That's been there forever. Yeah, I know. I know. Mm. It's a very, very nice place, yeah. I, I didn't see you when I was there. Um, it's strange because we probably don't go at the same hours because I go there a lot. Do you really? Yeah. With my grandchildren, yes, I do. Really? You, take, you have grandchildren? Yes, wow. grand, big one and small ones. <laughs> now, when, when you say, when you say, yeah, ignore them. I, That's what I was told. Yes, I don't bother with them. The, uh, the, the big grandchild, uh, is. Uh, do you mean an abnormally large child? No, when I say big, I mean, uh, I mean tall. Oh, 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 tall. Very right. tall. Right. Mm. Did you grow up in Paris? Yes, I do. I was born in Paris. Really? And grew up in Paris, yes. That's lovely. So you live exactly where you used to live your whole life? <laughs> Well, in the same city, but I was not on the left bank. No, I was in another side of Paris, but I, I was born in Paris, yes. Which part of Paris were you born in? Uh, Paris 16, Port d'Auteuil, this area. That's very posh. That's going to be very boring for them, you know that. <laughs> Pardon my French, madam. Ooh la la! <laughs> the, uh, <laughs> the, 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 it's an expression. The, uh, the, the 16th is a very wealthy neighborhood, isn't it? Are you come from... No, 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 not really. really? I always thought... It's a very big area, so some parts of, are quite bourgeois and wealthy. Right. Some are much more popular. That's where I lived. Do you, do you travel well? Do you have a good time? Because I always think Parisians are always very unhappy when they're outside. It's like New Yorkers, when they leave the city, they're kind of like, I don't like it, uh, I want to get home. Oh, no, 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 I like to travel. Really? Okay. Have you ever lived in the United States? No, but I spent time when I, uh, I came first time to, to learn English and uh, I 
to stay for two to three months in New York. In New York? It was difficult because I was quite young and I left my son in Paris, but I never really lived in, uh, in America. I lived a little in England when I was married for a while. Uh, which part of England? London? London, yeah. Yes. I didn't see you there either. <laughs> You were not there yet. <laughs> oh, I might have been. I don't know. But I... No, no, I don't think you... <laughs> <laughs> Do you ever go down to the Cannes Film Festival? Do I go there? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you like it? So-and-so. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I went there once and I had dinner with a very beautiful actress who was eating a uh, crab and the crab leg got stuck in her mouth. And uh, what did you do? I, she didn't know. I, and I didn't know what to do, so I just I let it don't hang Don't tell there. me the name of the person. I'm not asking you. Eh? I'll tell you. No. <laughs> All right. I won't tell you. I'll tell you. Do you minute. go often to Cannes Festival? No, I used to when I worked in the film business, but then I failed at it and I had to do this. <laughs> so, um... That was a good, a nice change, no? It's nice because the film, you know in films well, you have to travel. you all the time. Well, yeah, I know. I have to work all the time and it's cold and it's damp. It's like being in Scotland. <laughs> I love Scotland, it's beautiful. Yeah, that, yeah. what do you... So I go to Cannes Festival very often because you, when you have a film presented, you have to be there, you know. Have you ever been a judge at the Cannes Film Festival? I was vice president with Clint Eastwood, yes, a, a year. Oh, mm. he's American, you know. Very American. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> do you get along with him? Um... <laughs> We were many people, you know, we were both, you know, presidents and there were many people, a lot of languages, you know, Russian, English, Italian. That's uh, not at all what I yes, asked you. No, but I'm not, that's the beginning of my answer. Oh, right, okay, okay. Because right. it's not fast enough. Because there were a lot of translators, you know, so we were never in a thing that we were all could talk together, you know. Yeah. It's very cool. I'm, I'm supposed to be cool, he's much cooler than I am. No, I think you're pretty cool. Well, he's very, so maybe he's a little uh, he's very cooler. Yeah, he's very tall. And, and very thin. Thin, very tall and thin, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's, a, he's a bit like Topher Grace. Have you ever met Topher Grace? <laughs> no. <laughs> the gentleman that was on before, he was a... Uh, <laughs> yes, I saw that. Yeah. Hey, um, we have kind of a tradition here at this show that when... Uh, when I'm afraid. The, no, 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 I would, no, please, I would never do anything disrespectful to you, an international no, woman on no. International <laughs> Women's Day. <laughs> <laughs> no, I thought that, um, that dress is lovely, by the way, may I say? I like the fact that it shows your shoulders. Hmm, good. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, we have a tradition, because we're very poor, uh, oh, really? Yes. This you mean in the studio or in... Uh, in, in well, I else? personally am poor and also oh. the studio is, okay. is poor. I, I'm not so poor. I've got a car. But the... Uh, <laughs> the um, we don't have a band. So we like to end each interview with either an awkward pause or a mouth organ. I hope that translates okay. No, I didn't, I didn't get the second part. Mouth organ. Harmonica? Uh, uh, harmonica, yes. Harmonica? It's the same in French? Yes, harmonica, yes. Oh, we have an H. Yes. <laughs> so do we. So do we. <laughs> so, would you, would you like a harmonica? No, no, I don't know what to do with that. I think you do. No, I don't. What's the, what's the other option? <laughs> the other option is to end with an awkward pause, where we will improvise a very awkward moment between us. But I think that's going to be difficult, frankly. Okay, so you propose I uh, play? Oh, yeah. no. <laughs> no, you don't have to. Uh, we, we, we can do an awkward pause. Would you like to awkward pause? We'll just end awkwardly. Like what? Like me standing up and sitting in your... No. What? Yes. Sitting on the other side of the chair? You, no. You're Catherine Deneuve. I'm not here to direct you. <laughs> no, but I was not prepared to this. Scene. Well, okay then. then so we'll we just... have time to talk about it. Well, let's, let's work through the scene a little. I think the, uh, your uh, motivation here is, how do I get away from this idiot as quickly as possible? <laughs> not really. You're wrong. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm not a very good partner. I know... Being French, I'm not fast enough. I know I'm not the best partner. Oh, I think you're doing just fine. <laughs> no, but it's true. <laughs> no, I think, I think you're being very tough on yourself. You know, that's another French thing too, you know. You want to be well, tough? yeah, very self-analytical and critical of no, yourself. No, 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 no. Oh, that's right. It's the other way around. Uh, they're no, 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 no. Yeah, you're talking about the English. The English. Well, the English are quite arrogant, I think. Yes, that's what I meant. But you know the, the, uh, the Scots, I'm Scottish, the Scottish and the French. Are you Scottish? Yes, yes. You speak Ecosis? 
Ah oui, that's why you speak French. Yeah, a little bit. I don't like to, you know, people to know. Oh, you're ashamed. I'm not ashamed. I'm just, my French is very bad. And if you start ah, talking okay. to me in French, I'm going to look like an even more of an idiot than I do normally. I won't hurt you. I won't say anything. I won't okay. do anything. So, what I'm saying is the Scottish and the French have a very close alliance going back centuries because they hated the English. What are you up to? <laughs> what are you up to now? <laughs> I'm not sure, but I'm enjoying myself. <laughs> what are you up to? Uh, uh, waiting for the, your next... Uh, no, 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 <laughs> I swear, I, I swear, I'm not, I'm not playing what any game. What is that mug? Is that your mug? Yes, it's... <laughs> are you familiar with the term, a, uh, uh, it's, it's kind of a, it's Freudian, really. I'm insecure about my penis. <laughs> well I understand. <laughs> Ah, yes, it's very known. The snake and the spiders. Spiders? I've never heard spiders. Spiders? No, a spider for women, it's the same thing than the snake for men. Really? The fear of. Uh, are you afraid fear of snakes? Of, uh, not really, no. no. Oh, you're not? No. I, but tell me about a fear of spiders, because I know some women who are frightened of spiders. Is it a fear of female. It's, uh, it's also sexual things like, uh, like the snake. Really? Mm hmm. <laughs> So, no, I'm genuinely so interested. I swear. I, I, so no, no. I, I believe you. I trust you. I mean, where does that... Where does it, it take us? Oh, yes. don't, don't bring your own we here, Catherine. <laughs> no, the, the, uh, we're upbeat. It's America. Come on. De -de 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 -de. <laughs> so, um, so, snake for penis and uh, spider for ladies' business. Well, yes. It's supposed to be something around that, yes. Well. well. There you know. Well, I think this is kind of an awkward pause. <laughs> Ideal place to take them. I am delighted to meet you, madame. I am, I am such a fan of your work. It's very nice that you're here. You were in Paris, no? Yes, I've been in Paris. And where do you go in cafe when you go to Paris? I go to, uh, I used to go to Dumago Go a lot, but it gets, ah. it's, it's very expensive and very busy. So you went to the other one, Le Floor? No? Kind of Le Floor, yes, yeah. of course. I've seen you around there a little bit. <laughs> With my telescope. <laughs> I actually, I just remembered, I actually held a door open for you once at the Cannes Film Festival at a restaurant. Now, you probably don't remember. No. But you said thank you at the time. I'm very polite. Yeah, well, there you go. <laughs> Who would have thought? <laughs> Catherine Deneuve, everybody. Because the movie Christmas Carol opens today. Yes, that's right. The Christmas movies are being released earlier and earlier every year. <laughs> Craig, you're right. <laughs> We're completely, quietly listening to you. <laughs> In a way which is distractingly real. Hmm, I can see his point. They are. They're, <laughs> they're, I'm sorry, I'm not used to having people listening to me.